Hi, this is my class project about crimes. I tried to make uh, reviews about some vocabularies from Unit 10, add more information about crimes in general, and make a connection with Peak Blinders. Talking a little about the TV series, Peak Blinders is a British crime drama and historical fiction TV series created by Stephen Knight that has six seasons and already has planned for a seventh. The main plot is about Thomas Shelby and his brothers return to Birmingham after serving the British arm during the First World War. Uh, and Shelby and the Peak Blinders, the gang he is leader of, control the city of Birmingham, but as Shelby's ambitions extend beyond Birmingham, he plans to build a, on the business empire he's created and stop anyone who gets in this way. And one of the most interesting curiosities about the production is that it's inspired by a family with the same name who worked in the same region and the fact that the series mixes fiction with reality is that makes it more interesting. And now I'm going to talk about some crimes committed by Peak Blinders and their types and punishment based on the Brazilian Penal Code. Crime of physical aggression has four different levels that the punishment can vary from 3 months to 12 years in prison. The simple is an aggression that promotes bruises, fainting or non-permanent pain. The serious is that which leaves the victim unable to perform tasks for a period of time. And the very serious is that which causes a permanent disability or deformation in the victim. And with death is with death. And now murder is a type of, is that has many classifications from culposo to qualified. And depending on the case, the, pun the punishment can vary from 6 to 30 years in prison. Simple is the action to kill a person without cruel aggravations or without dominance of violent emotion. The culposo is when the person uh, was to blame for what happened, but without intention. But homicide happens only if the crime is intentional and has specific details, the qualifiers, like financial, irrelevant or discriminatory reasons, if it was premeditated, and has traces of cruelty. And the last one, the privileged, is when the accused is motivated by a state of violent emotion, is one of the most common. And now the torture, it's extremely cruel and unfair treatment, often toward prisoners. The punishment for serious or very serious can vary from 4 to 10 years, and with death, 8 to 16 years, but can change with aggravants. Now, kidnapping is illegally depriving a person of their freedom. The punishment from the simple can vary from one to three years. And if the kidnapper requires money to release the victim, the punishment can vary. The punishment can vary from eight to 15 years in prison. Arson is a, it's a type, it's a crime that is within a specific type of crime, the vandalism, and the punishment can vary from 3 to 6 years and fine. And now, uh, getting in a little into the crimes committed by authority, we have the abuse of authority that take advantage of the position to assert individual interests. The punishment can vary from 1 to 4 years and fine. Now, uh, intimidation is one of the most common crimes in this list. 
It's very similar to the crime of aggression, but there are some differences. Is when you treat someone mentally or physically, and the punishment can vary from two to four years and fine. Is decided based on the severity of the intimidation. Terrorism is one of the most serious crimes committed by peak blinders and is one of the few crimes that have the maximum punishment in the Brazilian Penal Code. It consists of acts of crime against a group, political or religious, or another country. Punishment can vary from 12 to 30 years in prison. And I chose this image because, as I said at the beginning, the fact that the series mixes reality with fiction is one of the strongest points of the series. And this man on the right is Houston Churchill, the Prime Minister of the United Kingdom. And this is a crime that needs no explanation. Just and use of legal firearms, the punishment can vary from 3 to 12 years in prison. And the last crime of the list, the white collar crime, uh, is, it's a type of crime that occurs when you break in the law in business. The punishment can vary from 3 to 10 years and fine. But in Brazil doesn't give anything if you, if you are a friend of any politician or have a lot of money. Now I will talk about some vocabularies that I found. Court, places for the trial and administration of justice. Prison, place for detention. And the last one, arrest. In today's story, Skeletor was looking for a shortcut, a quick way to riches and power. You may know some people like that, always looking for the quick way to get ahead of everybody else. Well, it doesn't work that way. The people who succeed are the ones who work for what they want. So don't be fooled by those who say they have a sure thing. There's always a catch to it. Don't sell yourself short. The right way is the best way. Until later, 